hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here then please like and subscribe. So in today's video we're going to be opening up the Glossy Box Birthday Edition. So I'm very excited for this month's box because I know that from the sneak peek we're going to be getting a Huda Beauty liquid lipstick and I always love it when they put a Huda product in these boxes. So very high hopes for this month's box and the packaging is really pretty. It's this hot pink with a bow on the front. Okay, so we've just got the leaflet which tells you what's inside. And then the wrapping is black. Oh, I always rip these, I can never do these nicely. Oh, come on, done. Okay, so first up we have the Huda Beauty liquid lipstick, which I'm very excited to try. So let's swatch this color. Oh, it's very dark. It's like a vampy kind of mauvey purple tone, if that even makes any sense. I really like that colour actually. Actually it's more burgundy than purple. It's kind of hard to describe this kind of shade actually. Yeah, I really really like that. Okay, so yeah, I really really like this shade. It's like a in between a purple and a kind of burgundy berry shade. And this shade is called Lady Boss. And the packaging on this is just a glass bottle. And these retail for 18 pounds. And this is a demi matte lipstick, which means it's not drying like a lot of matte formulas normally are. It feels really comfortable on the lips. And this says, it wouldn't be a posse party without Huda Beauty. This creamy lippy boasts a luscious, highly pigmented formula that glides effortlessly onto your lips, adding an intense shot of colour to your palette. It then dries to a satin finish, creating a sheen on your lips. Um, so next up, we have a Steve Laurent product in this rose gold packaging. And I believe that this is actually a lip liner. So I saw in other people's unboxings that their lip liner was actually the same kind of colour, like they've matched it to the Huda Beauty lipstick. So let's swatch these and see if they've done that on mine. Yeah, that does look really similar actually. So let's swatch them compared. Yeah, the shades are really similar. So they would go really nicely together. And the lip liner is in the shade Vogue. And, and this is worth £12.09. I don't really know why they put the nine pence on there. That's a really random price. Okay, so next up we have this, um, the Brushworks Wonder Complexion Sponge. So I'm really glad that they actually put one of these in here because my Real Techniques one is getting a bit dirty and yeah, this needs to go in the bin. I've washed it so many times that it just doesn't really get clean anymore. I mean, I wash my brushes at least once a week, but I can never seem to get these clean properly. Oh, and it's a really nice pink colour. And the shape to this is exactly the same as the Real Techniques ones. It's got a flat top and then a pointed kind of round bit. And this retails for $5.49, which the price is actually very similar to the Real Technique ones. I'm pretty sure these are about five pounds as well. So yeah, I think this will be a really good sponge to be honest. It feels really nice and dense and just like a sponge. <laughs> okay, and then next up, we have one of the new skincare products from the Glossy Box range. And this only launched a few days ago. Um, so this is the Eye Boost Cream. And it's in this really cute little pink packaging. And this retails for £16. And if you are already a subscriber to Glossy Box, then I believe you get about 10 to 20%. I'm not quite sure what the percentage is, but you do get a certain percent off of the Glossy Box skincare range if you're already subscribed. So yeah, that feels really nice. It's not too thick and that's just absorbed really quickly. And yeah, it's not left it feeling still dry. It just feels really nice and moisturised. So yeah, I think that looks like quite a nice eye cream. And this is 15 mils, and I'm pretty sure the other eye creams that I've used, I've tried the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Eye Rescue and the Clinique little eye cream pot, and I'm pretty sure they're about 15 mils as well. 
Okay, and then last but not least, we have a molten brown shower gel. And this is the same delicious rhubarb and rose. So you can really smell the rhubarb in that. It's a really, really lovely scent. And this is a deluxe mini 100 mils, which retails for £7.33. And if you were going to get this in the full size, which is 300 mils, it would have been £22. That's rather a lot for a shower gel. Yeah, I really like the scent of that. And I love that they've done everything pink in this month's box. So I'm really impressed with this month's box. I think this is actually the best month that we've had so far. So yeah, all together we got a Huda Beauty liquid lipstick, which retails for £18. A Steve Laurent lip liner, which is £12. The Glossy Box eye cream, which is £16. A beauty sponge, which is £5. And a Molten Brown shower gel, which is £7. So I haven't got my calculator on me right now because I'm filming on my phone. So I'm going to add all of that up and then put the total price here for you. So if you're new to Glossy Box, how it works is you pay a monthly subscription. So you can either pay £13 a month and you can cancel any time, or you can go for a 12 month contract. They used to do three months, six months, or 12. I think they're only doing 12 at the minute. And I believe that's a discounted price around 11 pounds a month if you sign up for the whole year. And then also after every month, once you get your Glossy Box, you can also fill out surveys on all of the product, which you'll get Glossy credits for, which you can then either put towards your next box or you can spend at Look Fantastic which is an online website. If you haven't heard of it before, it's like Beauty Bay, Look Incredible, all of those kind of sites. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll link all of the products mentioned today in the description box. If you have any questions about any of the products or about Glossy Box in general, then leave me a comment down below. So if you'd like to see more videos like this, then please like and subscribe. I upload new videos every week so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.